G'day folks, this is Ed and this is a very large cycle reversing valve from a very big package unit air conditioner it's one of two valves from the system which is fitted with two compressors as you'll see in one of my other videos I'm not sure what the tonnage capacity is on the cooling I'd say probably roughly 40 to 50 tonnes cooling capacity the valve is made by Ranco USA as are most of these the cycle reversing valve basically operates by taking pressure from this point here using the solenoid to move a piston inside here either one way or another diverting gas through each of these tubes it's simply used to divert liquid and high temperature gas either for cooling or heating it'll divert high temperature gas to the interior coil or the evaporator unit to heat the room or it will divert liquid to the interior unit to cool the room in a moment I'll attempt to dissect and dismantle this valve to show just how it works this is the cutaway of the cycle reversing valve as you can see the top sections come off this is a high pressure high temperature gas tube from the compressor compressor discharge comes straight out through here and into the body right now it is in heat mode where the compressor suction is drawing from the condensing coil rather than discharging to it the suction in from the interior unit is receiving gas from the compressor high temperature gas so there's high temperature gas flowing through and out the suction line to the interior coil to create heat if I were to slide this across this would change it to cool mode where gas, low temperature gas from the interior unit is siphoned into the compressor high temperature gas comes out through the high temperature tube on the compressor down to the condensing coil where it is condensed back into a liquid and continues the cycle back to here where obviously it comes through here through this little chamber and back into the compressor in gas form a fairly simple design as I said before the solenoid here takes high pressure gas from the high pressure discharge side of the compressor and uses it to push this little sled forwards or backwards depending on which cycle is required and pressure equalization in this surrounding chamber pushes this Teflon seal hard against the bronze slide plate and creates a, a nice seal as you can see on this condensing unit this is the high pressure high temperature gas from the compressor coming up here you have the control solenoid which will divert gas into either end of this tube this first line coming off goes to the condensing coil the middle line is the suction line for the compressor and the far line is the condensing coil so high temperature gas can go through here to be condensed or if it's running in reverse the condensing coil becomes the evaporator coil and the compressor draws this gas from there in heat mode and discharges the high temperature gas out through the suction line 